Hey Ghouls, uh, Doc Sledge here. This is the Regeneration Weekly Update 2. Uh, it's been a rough week. Um, I have lost more weight. I've lost a total of 26 pounds, uh, which is great. It's fantastic. Uh, my blood sugar, we had a major issue. Um, I think it was earlier, between the last video and this video, we had a major issue where my blood sugar dropped to about 60. That wasn't good, so um, Actually, we got some good news with that, that I was taken off of the second of three diabetes medications, which is really good, really, really good. So I'm only on one, which is uh, called Humalog. It's three, it's a dosage of 10 units three times a day, so it's, it's pretty piddly. I was taken off of a thousand units of metformin and 30, well, I was originally at 80 units of uh, Lantus and they dropped that in 30 then they axed it all together so that, this is a good thing um, I'm also on a new medication called Ursadol which is supposed to prevent um, gallstones oh my god the side effects of that medication are the worst seriously it was, I was supposed to take it twice a day oh my god uh, it basically wipes out all energy that I have or yeah, an energy that I do have. I'm dizzy. I can't. I can't function. I cannot do anything. I'm just up and down, up and down, up and down. Like oh, I mean seriously. I was homebound for two. Sorry, not to swear. Days because of this medication. It sucks. Um, really, really nasty medication. So uh, we decided to. I'm a little shitty even to the gym. Uh, I did two and a half miles today. Uh, yeah, it's, we had to reduce it down to one, one pill at night and seriously increase my water intake because it was just, it was so bad. I mean, lightheaded, dizzy, seeing floaters, back aches, muscle pain, everything. It was just, and I would just have a cold sore from it. That's how bad it was. Now, uh, the other thing that's going on right now is our one of our cats, Tinkerbell, she's sick. Um, we don't know what's going on with her. Uh, she she did have a little bit of a worm problem, so we medicated that, and um, worms are okay. Or, well, they're dead, gone. But her belly is very, very swollen, and we're very worried about it. We've been dealing with this for about uh, a couple weeks, and we've been in contact back and forth with our that and um, she's very she's been very lethargic over since yesterday and today and we're very worried about her and I called the vet and I said look we need to get to the bottom of this we need to get her healthy I don't care how much it what it takes we're gonna get it done well when we took a, a poo sample there was some blood in her stool this morning so I'm pretty freaked out about that um, I know it's probably I hope I hope to whatever gods are listening that Take your belt, be okay. <laughs> Excuse me. Uh, yeah, she's she's my baby. Uh, well, Spooky's my baby too, but she's you know I love both my kitties the same amount, and to me they're my babies, and I love them more than anything. And uh, I just don't want her sick, and I don't want um, you know the whole yeah it's tumors or whatever. You know, I, I don't want bad news. I want good news. Yeah, uh, gotta get, yeah, sorry. I, uh, it, just thinking about, you know, the possibilities of her being, you know, the current conditions being bad is just not doing me any good. So, um, yeah, uh, back to the update. Um, yeah, things are good. Uh, blood sugar's down, 26 pounds down. Um, I'm seeing a weight range I haven't seen in about 10 years, so that's really good. Um, I'm on a pureed diet. Um, I have not pureed a damn thing because I am a I have problems with textures. And if I eat something that the texture is not right, I will. Uh, so basically, I had the option of like uh, smashing up some tuna fish, canned tuna fish, canned chicken, canned turkey, and adding some mayonnaise and seasonings and stuff. And boy, I made a t oh, I made 
uh, I got some canned um, crab and some canned mini shrimps. Tried making something out of that. Um, not blend, not blend. Oh god, oh. just like add a little bit of mayo and seasonings, and it came out like crap. I mean, I I used like eight different seasonings just to add some flavor to it because it, it tasted like fishy nothingness, and that didn't work. So I added some. I'd like. A ton of, of South uh, Southwest Citrus Fiesta stuff made by McCormick. Um, I let it sit overnight. I'm kind of afraid to try it because it tasted like fishy nothingness yesterday. So we're going to see how that goes. Um, I also tried some deviled ham spread in a can. That's pretty good. Pretty good, surprisingly. Um, so yeah, that's it for this week's update. I just hope that Tinkerbell is going to be okay. All right. Uh, have a good afternoon, ghouls. I uh, hope things go well. Actually, no, I'll do a video update on Tinkerbell after we find something out. All right. Have a good one, ghouls.